Okay, so here we are on day six. This morning is really foggy, which actually has been relatively foggy every morning. It's 100% uh, humidity. So this fog is good for the plants and the trees and what have you. But it does get everything wet. As you can see here, this is all from the fog dripping off the roof. So anyway, today they will continue and we'll see about renting some farms uh, either today or tomorrow to put the concrete uh, on top of the wall and at that time also those uh, rebar things there will go on top of here so you'll have about uh, 30 centimeters of concrete all the way around now in case you're wondering why those are taller than the rest of it is because there in the corner I'm gonna make two rooms one for storage of feed and the other one for rabbits and then as you see in the middle there you have short columns followed by a big one followed by a big one right there on that side you're also going to have two more rooms uh, for chickens and in the center it'll be fenced in but it'll be for the chickens to have a place where they can go and get shade get out of the rain whatever but the roof to those two rooms will actually go from here it'll go all the way down to the other side so it'll be a solid roof all the way through but that's for a later date project okay so now we'll wait for these guys to get here and see what happens okay this is day six these guys are here and they're getting everything ready the the rebar was delivered so now they can continue making those things and we'll see what happens today okay so they've laid in their string now they're going through and making sure that the ground is where it needs to be They're mixing up some mortar and they're moving blocks all along where it's going to be laid. And he's over here cutting some of that uh, number six round bar. And so the fun continues. And this morning, they're supposed to come and deliver more block and more cement, Portland and uh, mortar. We'll see what time they get here. Okay, so here they are getting the level. They're using that uh, 
little pipe full of water so it's a little water level and they're making sure that it's in line all the way down to the other end the first uh, layer is the most important one because that dictates every row after that so these guys take a lot of time to make sure that those settings those measurements are correct so that's good okay so they've come to deliver 500 blocks and they will come back again and deliver 500 more for a total of a thousand they've already started putting in the first row of block they also delivered five mortar five portland and then we'll come back and deliver five more of each and uh, the OG here, the supervisor, is checking the bags to see if they're, hey, hey, to see if they're torn. If they're not, he wants to tear them. Hey, you, here, go play with that ball. No tearing of the bags. Huh? You can supervise, but you can't tear the bags. Okay, so there is four. Two by fours, and I will use these along with some other ones that I have to make a frame around this and the other panel to make a gate that will go back here. It will go here. So the panel is back there and this one is leaning up against the fence here will be the fence gate there. Okay, these guys are finishing up the second course and uh, they've started on the third. And they will put, same as yesterday, Four on one side of the column and four on the other and that will go all the way around so the plan is to finish this today and then tomorrow I imagine that they will do both this 34 meter section and the 13 meter section that's at the end of this fence here so we'll see okay there it is two three well on its way And the project is starting to take shape. It's starting to look like a fence. Okay, here's looking at it from the other side. And there's the blocks that were just delivered. And they've got one more truckload to deliver after that. And I'll leave it up to them, but it probably go somewhere in here. Or maybe even down at that end down there. Up to them. They're the ones that have to carry them back and forth, so whatever they want to do. It's okay with me. OK, 
Okay, it's after lunch. And they've started the inside run. They're working on the first row. And the idea is to finish this side today. Hopefully. Hopefully they get done pretty quick and then they can actually start on the other side or at least set it up. The thing is, yesterday they only had three guys putting down block. Today they actually have four because the guy that was welding this is actually putting some block in there. So with four, it goes very, very quickly compared to three. Okay, so right now they're working on the second run, just about finishing. Some of them are actually starting on the third. So they'll definitely be done with that today. Then after that, uh, I don't know if they'll make some of these uh, rebar things or I don't know. We will find out when they do it. Yeah, I almost forgot uh, the uh, delivery that they made this morning of cement and, uh, and block was only half. But uh, they haven't been back. It's uh, right around 3 o'clock and they're still not back. So I don't know. And all the mortar, we had seven bags. That's it, they've used them down there. We had seven bags and they're already on their last bag over there. We called and they said that they were in another delivery. So I don't get it. If they made half the delivery, obviously we were on queue, but I guess we were only half on queue because they went on a different delivery to a different person, so I just don't get it. Exactly, I don't get it. I have no cement now. So we called and they said, uh, if you want some cement, come get it. Well, Unless a contractor goes to get it, I don't have a truck to go get it. Well, I guess we'll do what we'll do when we get there. Okay, so after several phone calls, we got the block. And uh, we got some... We got some mortar. Portland so I guess this is good until we need more I guess it's good till we need more okay so the level was checked between here and the cement rings and it's okay. And they should be able to knock this little wall out this afternoon. And then tomorrow, it'll be this 34 meter section. All right. Okay, this is the end of Day six. And now we've got uh, the beginning of a fence. And it goes all the way down to that corner down there. And then over here. Oh. 
there's one row and the second one started they'll come back tomorrow and continue okay so I'm standing at the first corner looking down to the second corner and there goes these guys they're going home see you tomorrow Okay, so here we are at the second corner. Okay, here we are at the gate, looking out towards the back of the property. And here we are on the little 13 meter run. that will go and connect to that existing fence. Wait. Okay. Even with all the struggles and what have you, things are going good. Hey, 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 hey. Enough, enough. Even with all the little struggles here and there, things are going good. Starting to shape up as a fence pretty soon. The OG can come out here and run around and not pull up the shrubs and what have you. He can come play with the weeds over here. And here what I've got going on is I'm starting the frame that will house these two panels and it'll be the the gate since I am putting chain link fence on the top section this will match it very nicely okay so let's go about the business and uh, tomorrow's another day okay see ya thanks for watching see you next time see you bye bye